Okay, so now we're going to do this view of the globe right here. Okay, so let's take the compass and make our circle. Okay, and then off we go. So, alright, we're going to start about here. Okay, so let's put a dot right there. And we're going to start and we're going to draw a line that this is like Alaska. So it's going to come down there and it's a little bumpy and go like that. So it's a little bumpy with, think of it like a chin coming out and then going back. So it comes back, makes a bump and then starts heading that way. And we can kind of have it come out a little bit and then go out and down. So then you're heading down into Canada and then back into the United States. So we're kind of looking at the very top um, of the globe here. So there's a little bit of Alaska. Well, we can put a bump on it. And then maybe it comes in. And then we're going to make like a kind of a point. It's going to go like that and like that. And then we're going to make like a, let's see, it's going to go down, making to there and like that. Not going quite to the edge of the globe there. Then it's going to come back to the point. And let's take our sky blue. And that right there is, so we're into Canada, and this is what's called um, the Hudson Bay. So we're back to that point. And we're going to come out just a little bit. And then kind of go like that. And then we're just kind of going to go, it's almost like going this way and up and that. some little islands there so we can just draw a bunch of little islands so let's color in that it's another bay there start here we're going to go up like that out like that and down and let's just so we don't get confused let's take uh, that green color okay let's just take that So just so we don't get confused, let's color that in green. And we can color this right here. 
let's just color that green. So that's Alaska and the top of Canada. Just so we don't get confused. And then we're going to go back. And we're just going to go a line that goes like that. Okay, and then we can color the rest of this green. So, we're looking at the top of the earth here. And we can bring the water out here. This is the Arctic Ocean. Okay, so we've got that. So there we have Alaska going down into Canada and then back into the United States. So what are we going to connect here? Well, right over here, there's these little islands, so we should draw those. A bunch of little islands off the coast of Africa there. I mean, um, Alaska. And then here, we're going to draw this kind of a shape like that. Almost looks like a dog's head. Now, okay, let's see. Now we're going to go, so I guess we're going to go down this way. All right, you're going to go down this way. And... going to put like a island right there and then we're going to go in like that and down And it gets kind of bumpy here. It goes in like that. And then right here, we'll make a dot. And going to be an island like that. And so this right here, so we've got Alaska there. Let's take our green. Right there is Japan. So now we are ready to, we can draw some, let's color in the water over here. Go around all that. We can just go a little bit through there. Alright, so I'm just going to kind of make an outline around everything. And then just color it in just softly. And we know this is all water. And this is the um, North Pacific up here. I just went right, right on top of Japan with the blue. That looks, it's a good way to color it. That looks good. I think we'll just throw a little blue over the green too. What the heck. Some of my white spaces, the little white spaces, get rid of those with the blue. Because blue looks nice on top of green. <laughs> All right. Now we're going to go after some more land here. We're going to go over to, this is the, like, Russia over here on the top. So now we're going to go... There's the dog's head, sort of. We're going to go out like that. Maybe put a little tail on him. And, and then we're going to go.
go around here, maybe do another bump. It looks like another tail. And then we're going to wind it, wind it, kind of pretend you're almost making a bay there, like that. And then just throw a little leak in here. over there and make a bump. And we're going to put in some islands here. There's lots of little islands up there. Maybe put one over here. Okay, so I guess the best thing to do is let's do the green. We'll color in our islands and we'll color in this. So this is the top of, that goes, the top of this over here is Russia. The farther you go over, you get into Europe, the top of Europe. On that side, and over on this side, like I said, there's Japan, and then you go down, and from Russia you go into Mongolia or China. Arctic Ocean, which would be all covered with snow, because that's the North Pole up there. Okay, so let's just put a dot right around there, just so that... Okay, so let's make this side a little darker. I'm going to take that green and just kind of push down on the edge a little bit and this thing's got a little darker over there. So we have the top of Europe going to sleep and Russia going to sleep and Japan going to sleep. And then I think maybe I'll switch to a, a light green, like this color called green yellow. And maybe I'll put a nice light green over here. I can throw a little bit of light green over here. So it's like it's just starting to wake up that side of the world. And then we'll put our dark blues. Periwinkle up there and down here. And a little bit of sea green out in front of it. Put a little sea green over the earth. Um, the land part, that looks good. So we got our North Pole right there. Uh, I think I'll take a dark blue, maybe go over this side of the earth and the water. blue color. Just plain blue. Give it a little dark. Make it a little darker. Maybe I'll 
I'll just go kind of outline a little bit with my pencil. I'll just make it all a little land. Forms a little darker. Top of Russia over there. With Japan, those islands. Up into the northern part of Canada. Maybe I'll just use my pencil and kind of outline the edges of the earth here. So if you want to label it, I thought we could go ahead and label it. Um, so just so we keep our bearings here, this is Alaska, A-L-A-S-K-A. -A. And this ocean right here would be the North, N-O, North Pacific, P-A-C-I-F. I see. Um, this island right here, I'm going to draw a straight line over to it. Japan. And let's do a line right to this dot there. And call that the North Pole. Oh. So that's where, you know, all that, that this is, oh, let's call this the Arctic Ocean. I'm going to go down a little bit, like that. A-R-C-T-I-C, -C, Arctic Ocean. And this is the Hudson Bay. That's what we call that one, Hudson Bay. H-U-D-S-O-N, Hudson Bay. So if this is the North Pacific, then over here would be the North Atlantic. N O A T L A N T I C. I forgot to color in that one island. There's another island right there. So that gives you a little idea of that neck of the woods.